Hello YouTube, this is Gajo Pilot and I would like to welcome everyone on this video. First of all, I would like to say Happy New Year to everyone as this is my first video for 2020. Right guys, as you guys have requested, this video will be about navigation. So I'll just show you my, a few things, easy steps, uh, how to navigate your aircraft following your flight plan. Okay guys, first thing you have to do is set your flight plan. and. My easy way to do so, just go to Google and or any other browser and press FPL2IF and this website will open up and so you just press on SIM brief, infinite flight and this is what you get. First thing, select your aircraft that you're flying, your departure airport, which in this case is Athens. So we're just gonna go ahead and go on the map and press on uh, just to see the code uh, so Lehman Golf Alpha Victor and also you have to go find your your arrival airport for which in this case will be Paphos in Cyprus so it's going to be Lima Charlie Papa Hotel okay uh, cruise altitude, I'll just leave it on to uh, the program to calculate it for me. And uh, we have reserve fuel for 13 minutes. Passenger count, uh, I'm going to go ahead and set my passengers according to this flight. So go back to weight and balance. Find the passenger count, which is 157 passengers. So we're just going to add that, scroll down until we find our passenger, there we go. So cargo weight, again we're going to have to find how, uh, how heavy we are, so in this case we are about 4.6, I don't know, I did a mistake there, we have to change it to 4.6, and that's it. Right, guys, uh, plan, step, pl uh, climb, not really. I don't need this for now, but uh, yeah, no. So, generate flight plan by pressing that. It will calculate everything for us. So basically, guys, navigation is really easy in infinite flight. You don't need to do much, just simple steps, which I will show you uh throughout this video so just waiting for the flight uh to get ready 100 percent when it's at 100 percent you just have to go back and this is your flight so copy flight plan okay and if you go down you can see all the information needed on descents climb speeds and also your cruise so this is basically a very good application a very good uh, place to find flights, flight plans and whatsoever, and it will calculate all your active airports. So basically guys, we're gonna have to check our fuel. Block fuel is at 6,938 kilograms. So we need to add all the uh, amount needed for this flight. Okay guys, it's always a little bit more than needed, but it's always good to have a bit of fuel on your aircraft when you, uh, when you are setting your flight. So basically this is the flight plan. So we just have to go back now. Okay guys, now you have to press on your maps and paste the flight plan that we copied earlier on. And this is what we get. This is the flight plan that uh, this program will give you according to uh, this flight. So basically just chooses all the runways there, active runways for you on our departure and arrival, but also this doesn't always have to be uh, spot on as sometimes, you know, we have ATC and uh, we, you will need to follow the ATC instructions. So you might need to just change the departure runway or the arrival runways. 
So guys, I basically go to nav and I just uh, have my map range to 320 as a beginning. So I can just have a clear view of my waypoints and also the compass, I have it on aircraft. So this is, uh, this flight is set and ready to go. Basically guys, what you need to do, just make sure that source has to be on GPS. So just leave everything as it is. Do not touch anything like the other buttons, like the CRS and the PRGs. Do not touch any of that, guys, as this will change the headings and also uh, some other factors, which we'll discuss sometime later on. So uh, for now, guys, uh, this is how things work. Just leave things as it is, just paste your flight plan and uh, just make sure your source is on GPS so you can follow the flight plan because if you have it on set on nav one from now and put you nav one you don't even have a selected airport which you will see on approach how this works uh, it's not worth it so we are ready to go okay guys just after we take off basically this is when we set our autopilot so basically you just have to go press on ap on set your desired vertical speeds and whatsoever you need your altitude but in order to follow your flight plan from this point you just have to press on the nav so nav gps just press on that and you can see the aircraft's dotting to follow the flight plan that we have already set so this is basically it for now guys and uh, this will control the flight exactly how our flight plan has been added until we reach our desired destination all right guys in order to set your nav one you have to go on the map press go further down to the right and press on runways choose the runway you will be landing in this case the runway 29 will be my landing runway and on the bottom you see you see set nav one so you can see this green uh, nav one popping out under the runway so now it's all set to start the approach in this case uh, I will be flying APPR so it's auto landing system which I would cut off at about a thousand feet and land manually but if you want to go through nav 1 without using the approach mode you can still do so but you need to descend and uh, follow the glide slope on your own so this is basically it. Okay guys, we are basically on left base, runway 29. And at this point, I'm gonna go on my autopilot and press on uh, APPR, as you can see there. So now the aircraft will start following the glide slope and uh, down to the runway. And this is basically it for today's tutorial. Uh, so basically guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. It's really simple steps to use in order to get those wheels down on the ground and Enjoy your flight. So basically if you do have any questions or any suggestions or any other requests Please put them down in the comment box like again guys happy new year And if you did like this video like share and subscribe if you haven't for more videos coming out in 2020 for now guys, bye Gajo Pilot, take care, have a good day, bye bye.